Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel and into another weekly grocery haul video. Now, if you're new here and you would like to, please hit that subscribe button, hit the like bell or the like thingy if you like watching grocery hauls. It is rainy, nasty outside today in Missouri, um, in Southeast Missouri. So, I apologize for the appearance here, but I wasn't gonna waste my time getting ready just to go to the grocery store and get all wet. So as you guys know, we're gonna be leaving for vacation on the 23rd, actually the 24th. So we are only buying the things that we need because I don't want a whole bunch of stuff sitting here. Um, just gonna to go to waste if we don't eat it before we leave. Um, we have about um, eight or nine days before we leave. So I'm only gonna be purchasing what I know we're gonna need meal-wise. Um, for the week so this total here that I'm gonna show you is $77 but I did buy two um, camping chairs because we needed two more um, which won't be in this grocery haul I won't show them to you because they're out in the garage now um, but $77 minus about $15 for those chairs is what's in front of you um, I only meal plan for about three different meals um, this week because we'll have things come up and we'll be doing things and we'll probably just eat leftovers or stuff like that so I didn't buy too much only the things that I know we're gonna need for lunches and um, dinners this week so I'm gonna turn you guys around and show you guys what I got and again I just went to Walmart for those of you guys that don't know in my little town we do have one grocery store but I'm not a big fan of that grocery store so I don't usually go there um, and then we have Walmart that's my option in my little town <coughs> I do apologize if I cough throughout this video I've been sick for a few weeks I feel really good but I still got this little lingering cough um, so I'm sorry if that bugs you I do apologize um, I got a bag of potatoes here. I got some bananas. I really try to eat a banana every single day. It just helps my body, um, my sodium and potassium levels inside my body. They help me pee out all the extra fluid that I um, intake. Like I've been eating a whole bunch of sunflower seeds which has a lot of salt in it. Um, and I like to have the bananas to um, kind of react that salt. Um, I don't eat sunflower seeds all the time, but now that it's getting warmer outside, the football games, the baseball games, all of the things are happening. Um, i just been wanting some sunflower seeds. So anyway, I got these bananas. Like I said, I try to eat bananas every day. And then um, I got some strawberries. Some of these aren't yet ripe, but by the end of the week, um, they'll do just fine. I got these peeled apples. They were on sale for $3.44. Um, and some of these probably, this is a pretty big container. How big is this? This is 32 ounces. Um, and some of these probably will go bad before we get them all eaten. But I'm going to be heavy on these in the lunch boxes this week. Um, and my kids just like fruit. So they'll be snacking on this all week. And then we have... Um, String cheese. This is string cheese right here, which is a staple in my kids' lunchbox. If you guys watch my lunch bo box video, you know gogurts and string cheese are like in lunchbox videos all the time because my kids really like them and they eat them all the time and don't have to worry about it. I got some hot dog buns, some sandwich bread. I thought these were super cute. You guys know me. If you guys have been around my channel long enough, you guys know that 4th of July is one of my very favorite holidays. Um, and so I thought these would be a cute little fun treat to put in lunch boxes this week. And this coming up week is the last full week of school, so it'll be my very last lunch box video. Um, you guys won't see that until next week, of course. Um, but it's my very last video for um, lunch box videos for the season for the school year. So. I just got a couple of these little mini pizzas and a nachos, just a little snack for the boys. Um, and then we have this, my husband really wanted these grilled cheese, Captain Wafers sandwich cracker things. Um, he loves these. He was at the store with me. Um, so anyway, we ended up picking these up. They're like $2.50. You get eight of them in there. 
eight packages and I think there's like six in each package or something. And then we're going to be having chicken alfredo tonight per Ethan's request. So I just picked up this pack of boneless skinless chicken breast for that. I got a can of cream of mushroom. And then I got just two cans of corn. Like I said, we're going to be working with the groceries that we already have on hand. I'm going to try to clean out my pantries and my refrigerator before we go on vacation. Um, just so that there's not stuff sitting around here. And then when I get back, I can go and do a grocery haul whenever we get back off of vacation. Because once we get back, we're going to be gone for about 11 days. And once we get back from that trip... You know, nobody's going to want to eat all the stuff that you eat when you go camping. They're going to want other things. So, anywho, I'm going to clean out. Between this week and next week, I'm going to be cleaning out um, the stuff that we have at the house and getting rid of all the old stuff so we can get all new stuff um, when we get back. And then I have just two of these classic Alfredo pasta sauces. I get these and then I kind of doctor the sauce up. Um, I don't mind this sauce. This sauce is really good all by itself. But I like add heavy cream. I add mushroom, cream of mushroom soup to my, to my sauce. I just do all of the things um, just to make it a little bit more tastier. And then we just got some garlic bread Texas toast. And then... We are going to do some rigatoni here for the chicken alfredo today. Of course, we got another box of gogurts go for lunch. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Gogurt for lunches. And then we got ham and cheese for lunches. And the boys uh, wanted meatball subs, hence the hot dog buns over there. I don't really do meatballs at all. Um, but they love meatball subs, so I went ahead and picked up this. I will doctor this up, of course, with some barbecue sauce and some grape jelly. And then the last thing we got over here is thin pork chops. And we are going to be having these with, like, fried potatoes and corn um, for dinner one night this week. And then the only other thing that I got was a big case of 40 bottles of water and then like I said those two camping chairs oh and I did get ooh, knocking stuff over I did get two of these little camisole not camisoles they're more like tank tops to wear under my exercise things for when we go camping so I got this one and I got a black one and that is it guys that is all that I got at Walmart this week um, like I said, if you are new here and you would like to, please hit that subscribe button, like the video, and we will see you guys um, in my next video. Bye!